In this video I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called solving a linear inequality with multiple occurrences of the variable problem type 1. We're asked to solve this inequality for v and we have both a v on the left hand side and the right hand side of the inequality. So rewriting to give myself more room. My goal will be to isolate the v but since I have v's on both sides I'm going to move the term on the right over to the left hand side so the 2v I will subtract 2v from both the left and right hand sides this will cancel the 2v on the right hand side since I'm adding and subtracting the direction of the inequality stays the same and I now have 37 minus a 6v on the left hand side and just the 7 on the right hand side and to continue to isolate the V, since there are two terms on the left hand side, I'm going to move the other term, the 37, to the right hand side by subtracting it from both sides, which again addition and subtraction do not affect the direction of the inequality. So we have canceled the 37 on the left hand side. I now have a minus 6V on the left and on the right hand side a minus 30. My last step for solving for v is going to be to divide by a negative 6 on both sides and here it's important to recall that when you multiply or divide both sides of an inequality by a negative number you change the direction of the inequality. And this is only true when multiplying and dividing by a negative. We wouldn't have to do this if that were a positive 6 that we were multiplying or dividing by. But since it's a negative, we change the direction of that sign, cancel the minus 6's to now have v isolated on the left hand side is less than, and then on the right hand side we have a positive 5. So we have isolated the v on the left hand side. 